Hello again, this is Robert Veach here. This is my video review of the Dovit brand, their weather station with wireless indoor and outdoor thermometer, humidity sensor right here, color LCD display. This has an atomic clock in there. It can be powered using this AC to DC adapter or batteries right in the back of the unit right here. It's got a nice kickstand and you could also mount this right on the wall with those holes right there and if you open this up right here you can put in three AA batteries if you want to power it that way it's up to you the power unit is right on the side right there with the barrel connector that is included we're going to power it up now one thing that the manual says right on the front is please make sure that both the main unit and the outdoor sensors are powered on within three minutes so we're going to add some AAA batteries to this and if you look close in there there is a little micro switch and you have three channels it defaults to channel one so you can have three other sensors if you want we're going to have it on channel one we're going to put some AAA batteries in there so now I have this unit powered on as you can see and it's displaying the temperature and the humidity right there and it has openings to let air in so we could sample it and you could put it right on the table like that, have it indoors or outdoors. And there's also a mount on there so that you can put it outdoors on your siding or on the wood of your house or on the metal, wherever you're gonna put it. So we have that ready. Now we can go and we're gonna power the main unit on. So I have the studio lights turned way down so that we can see this beautiful display on here. So I have it powered on for the first time. So here it's powered for the first time and uh, you can see the beautiful display on there try to minimize reflections and you can see it has the time there it's got the day i didn't set anything yet and predictions weather forecast right there barometric pressure phase of the moon and percent humidity indoor 67 degrees indoor outdoor would be this sensor right here we didn't synchronize it up yet so we have to do that but you can see it's a beautiful display, very easy, easy to see. On the top of the unit, it has all your settings for alarm, alerts, up and down buttons, channels, snooze light, and modes. So to make sure that this is connected to the channel one, I have it on channel one. I'm gonna hold the channel button down for a few seconds. And now what that's doing, it's communicating right there. It's blinking. And now you can see it's showing 70.9 and 26% humidity. So it's now matching what is on the sensor. So you take this, put it in any room you want. Let's say you got plants growing in some room, that could be your outdoor temperature, or put this outside. I'd recommend you put it where it's not direct under the rain, like under a porch. And then you get a real accurate temperature and humidity of the outside. So I'm going to go over some of the functions of this uh, device. This is a multi multifunctional weather station. It's uh, designed to aim at strong versatility and great convenience for your life. Station will show all the information you need, indoor, outdoor temperature, and humidity, maximum, minimum, customized alarm, snooze, time date, moon phase, pressure outside, pressure inside, um, weather forecast in 8 and 24 hours, 8 to 24 hours increments. Uh, three adjustable backlit levels and uh, you're just going to like this put this in your bedroom by your nightstand this is really cool it has a convenient indoor outdoor thermogrometer they're calling it which is what i showed right there it's going to measure humidity and temperature and as i mentioned this has an atomic clock so once you set this clock actually you don't even have to set it it's going to uh, connect to colorado and it's going to get the correct time and it's going to do that using an AM signal and it's going to be connected to the WWVB at 1 in the morning. And if you wanted to receive the signal anytime, you could long press the down key. So let's give that a try. There's a down key right here. Let's long press the down key, see if I can generate that signal. So notice this is blinking right here and it's trying to synchronize with Colorado. Let's just see what happens. 
So this is a 7.5 inch HD colorful display and uh, it's really nice technology because it doesn't seem to vary when you change the angle so it's like what they call an IPS display so it's very very accurate uh, and very very easy on the eyes it's very clear it's HD and it looks really nice now this is powered by batteries in the back the, uh, the, the screen will be only on for 8 seconds then it will terminate to save batteries because we're plugged in it's going to stay on and you'll be able to see the seven and a half inch beautiful display all the time. Now this is accurate and sensitive sensors. It comes with those outdoor sensors I showed right here that you could provide the two AA batteries. Now my experience is I've used this and those batteries will last over a year. It's pretty amazing. These are very accurate. So when you set this up, you're gonna know the exact outside temperature and the exact time once that thing syncs up with Colorado. And the, the range of this is really amazing because you'd be able to go 80 meters or 268 feet away and it'll still accurately send data to this outdoor channel right there. And that's pretty impressive. It's using a specially assigned frequency from the FCC. I'm not going to go into all the details and bore people, but there is all the information you need to set everything up on this device and it's really clearly written very nice. So after reading the manual, you see how that's blinking right there? It's attempting to make a connection to get the time automatic. And it does that in Colorado. And it does it at specific times. 1 a.m. in the morning, 2 a.m. and 3 a.m. And then it'll, it'll do 4 a.m. or 5 a.m. if it misses the first two. So right now it's 2 p.m. in the Midwest. So I'm not going to be able to get that signal. But when that thing stops blinking, it will lock on. And that will show the actual time and the date automatically. If you have this by your night table and you think that the display is too bright, I personally think this is perfect the way it is. If you want to hold down the snooze button, you then could change the brightness and dim it down. But you'll see that this is really perfect the way it is, I feel, just the way it is. So, But that's a way you can dim, dim it down if you want to. So after testing the Tovit brand, the weather station, with wireless indoor outdoor thermometer humidity sensor, color LCD, and atomic clock. What do I think? This is a really cool product. This is the second one I own. I have one of my upstairs, the same model, so I know exactly how well it works, how the time is accurate, and how the sensors are unbelievably accurate. This is a real cool product and it's going to make you feel real connected to the weather and the forecast does an amazing job and I like that it shows the pressure and the moon just really nice product I'm going to give it a full five star rating please remember to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon to alert the new video uploads and if you like this review please hit the like button I hope the information I presented helped you with all your buying decisions thanks for watching